Hello and welcome to the first episode of Web Design Quick Tips, a show dedicated to helping you get better as a web designer. Each and every week we'll be delivering a brand new web design quick tip which will be three to five minutes of basic instruction on how to do something cool in the web design world. In this week's episode we're going to be taking a look at how to utilize the new collapse menu feature inside of the WordPress dashboard. This is going to allow you to gain a little bit more control over the screen real estate that you're using while you're inside of the WordPress dashboard and also still gives you access to all of the tools that you need while you're working. So as you know in WordPress they've revamped the dashboard a few different times and recently they came up with this system with all the menus on the left. Now yeah, as you know you can expand these out by clicking the little arrows like so. However this is a hundred pixels of real estate that I'm giving up on my screen. And so if I have a smaller screen or I'm working on a laptop this is very valuable real estate that they're taking up. Luckily they've built in this command collapse menu. And if I choose this, all of my menu items get collapsed into icon form. If I hover over those given icons, they give me the option to access all of the pieces of the menu without having to have the menu expanded. It's really quick and really easy and allows you to get places without having the intrusive menu system in place. So the next time you log into your WordPress dashboard, check out the collapse menu feature. See if it doesn't help your workflow get a little bit better. Well. That's it for this episode of the Web Design Quick Tips Podcast. If you have any questions or comments, you can post them on our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash webdesigncom. You can also find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash webdesigncom. And follow us on Twitter. We're at webdesigncom. My name is Justin Seeley. Thank you for joining me, and I'll see you next week.